Hi, welcome to the video training of PHP. In today's video training, we will be learning about fibers in PHP 8.1. This is the new feature that has been introduced in PHP 8.1. PHP 8.1 adds support for fibers, a low level component which allows performing concurrent code execution in PHP. Fiber is a code block that contains its own stack of variables and states. These fibers can be considered as application threads and can be started from the main program. Once started, the main program won't be able to suspend or terminate the fiber. It can only be suspended or terminated from inside the fiber code block. After the fiber gets suspended, the control again goes back to the main program and it can continue executing the fiber from the point it was suspended. Refer to the spalling code snippet to understand how you can use fibers. So let's go to command line and here is my folder PHP tutorials PHP and I'm going to create another folder called fibers and let's set the permissions of this folder and let's uh, start sublime editor I'm using sublime editor and I'm going to call this file let's call it fibers.php okay and okay let's start and here we go with the php tag and initialize the fiber okay fiber we create a fiber object by the new keyword fiber and in the constructor we will be passing an anonymous function which returns nothing so it its return type is void okay so the second step we are going to do is we are going to print some message from inside the fiber before the fiber gets suspended so echo welcome to fiber and this is for line return adds a new space between two lines so it's backslash 9 n the second step we are going to do is to suspend the fiber so for that we use a static method of the fiber class that is suspend fiber suspend then we are going to echo another message to the user that says welcome back to fiber echo, welcome back to fiber and again here i'm using backslash n for line return so this is our initial fiber object that we are going to use okay below i'm going to create a simple echo message that says starting a fiber starting a fiber and again we have the line return okay then we are going to start the fiber so fiber again uh, so it's the start method of the fiber object and now that the fiber has been suspended right here with the suspend static method fiber has been suspended from the inside print some message and then resume the fiber so what i'm going to do is i'm going to echo some message fiber has been suspended okay backslash n and echo resuming the fiber backslash n and now we are going to resume the fiber fiber resume all right and the last is fiber has been completed so why fibers were introduced in php basically they were introduced to allow performing concurrent code execution in PHP 
which wasn't available before version 8.1 so it has its own stack of variables and states and now that we have written the program and let's save this program it is the last uh, ending tag of PHP is not compulsory or mandatory you can skip this now save this file and I'm going to open it in the browser so we can see the result or we can also run it on the command line so let's see we have fibers so php fibers dot php okay it says class fiber not found because my php version is 7.4.3 and it runs on php 8.1 so what we can do is we can find an online uh, php editor because currently uh, in this uh, tutorial I won't be able to install 8.1 or switch back otherwise it will take our tutorial to somewhere else on another topic so 8.1 online online editor or compiler I can see here okay so we have sandbox online functions php sandbox dot io so there are a couple of uh, websites that uh, give us this uh, option to run or execute our code or test it online okay we have the online IDE loaded here uh, on all these three websites so here is main.php file reload Execute online.php then we have this okay here we can paste our code so just copy the whole code control C and control V and you can set the version to 8.0 we don't have 8.1 here as well let's execute it it won't doesn't give any output because it doesn't have PHP 8 so let's check here if they have PHP 8.1 all right here I have found a website that provides PHP 8.1 online editor it's a very nice website so just paste your code right here and change it to 8.1.0 because this is the version where fibers have been introduced it was it weren't available in 8.0 so if I hit the eval function you see we have the output here starting a fiber let's go to our code so here a fiber has been started then the start function of the fiber object has been called so when the start function is called it we goes we go into the fiber object constructor where welcome to fiber is printed out here welcome to fiber then fiber has been suspended so when fiber has been suspended the message comes up fiber has been suspended right here afterwards we have we are resuming the fiber so when we are resuming the fiber we are calling the resume function of the fiber object and when we do that it says welcome back to fiber right here and at the end I have the message fiber has been completed so this is the last line of our program I hope that you have understood the concept of fiber and how you can utilize it in your own application thanks for watching this video subscribe to my youtube channel tech Weber and if you search if you uh, go online uh, youtube.com forward slash c forward slash tech weber s so i have taken that uh, uh, permanent url from youtube uh, tech weber wasn't available so i took tech webers so you can uh, go there and subscribe to my channel you can also contact me if you need any help my email address is umahmood at gmail.com Thank you very much for watching this video.